Duke Manuel. Here you are at last. Looked like so he went Gregory assless chaps for a second there. Thank you for agreeing to this meeting. I'll leave you with Johan a while. I still have a few things to settle. I shan't be long. See you later, Sir Gregory. Oh, good boy. Come over here. I'm warming myself up. I had the misfortune to step outside and I'm frozen solid. I wonder what he was doing outside. Something to do with what Holm asked him for, maybe. He's back from the Probably that Al Azif thing? Damn. He must have gone to deposit Al Azif for someone to pick up. Mr. Von Volner, I wanted to speak to you. I'd like to make you an offer you can't refuse. I'm all ears. Now, we don't have much time, so here it is. You will vote for Mortimer. What a strange idea, Godoy. You are <laughs> being ridiculous. Tell me now, why would I do that? Hmm. Let's do this. Damn traitor is about to drop us. Okay. Louisiana is Spanish. Consequently, I am best placed to know what to do with it. It's turning into a personal stake between Gregory and William. Honestly, would you like it if someone told you what to do with Royal Prussia and Greater Poland? Well, it depends. No, don't try smoothing things over. You are a statesman. You know what I mean. Today, Spain is weighed down by Louisiana, a source of epidemics, insurrections. It prevents us from concentrating on exploiting the wealth in the Western territories. And I have to let Gregory decide? I understand your point of view. Nice. But as far as I'm concerned, I would rather be honest. You are wasting your time, Duke Manuel. You know nothing about me, and your attempts to manipulate me have no effect. You behave as though we were close. Yet ever since you arrived, you've only been interested in your own little self. Don't say that, Johan. We may not be friends, but we are allies. Is that so? And what do you know about me, exactly? Hmm. If he knew I was Gregory's son... Oh, shit! He wouldn't try it on like this. Uh... About you? Next to nothing. Except that you happen to be Sir Gregory Holmes' son, right? What? What do you mean? But, uh... Ah... Now I'm starting to be of interest to you, no? Uh, I've never spoken to anyone about that. <laughs> Quite surprising, isn't it? You see, I'm full of surprises. In short, whether he's your father or not makes no real difference to me. Uh, speak for yourself. <laughs> Come on, Johan. Don't make me laugh. He has never thought of you as his son. I'd wager that you'd always hoped he would one day. Even though he treated you like a master treats a useful slave. He is, at best, a mentor. Stop me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Come on now. But, uh, tell me, why do you want to follow Mortimer all of a sudden? Mortimer is planning something. We don't know everything. He must have something up his sleeve to be so confident. Ah, really? Eh. Uh. What do you think that might be? How the devil did he find <laughs> out that I'm Holmes' son? This is tough. Um, hmm. He already had dealings with people above. He will kill anybody who opposes him. Let's see if he follows this. Mortimer is a demon, Johan. We have no chance of winning with Gregory. Ah, Occult to them, he's been vulnerable. Damn it! Have any idea what you are talking about? I know how it sounds, but I'm asking you to believe me. He can take control of any one of us, Johan. Shut and... up! I don't know how you found out, but hold your damn tongue! I know what Mortimer is, and all is run too. And they are not the only ones, believe me. <laughs> I hear everything you're saying. <laughs> But there is no chance that Mortimer can make us all change sides. That is why Sir Gregory can but win. You understand? Think again. It's already too late. Ah, I'm 
getting a bad feeling. Well, that doesn't help me. Hmm. There's only you left, or logic. That clever Dorishay turned try them this. all against what the? all of them. One by one, he somehow persuaded them to join Mortimer. But no, no, that's impossible. It looks like all of us have seriously underestimated him. While I don't know if this is gonna fly. He was running around after his poor mother. He was actually accomplishing the tour de force of winning us all over, one after the other. You're the only one left, Johan. I dare not imagine what Mortimer will do if he finds out you are against him. Because from now on, you're on your own. Good luck. No, no. Nice, wait. nice. I, the other one may have I, worked too. Honestly, betraying Gregory is... Well, it's... It's unthinkable, unless I simply don't have any choice. Yes, he's finally cracked. Thank you for warning me. You're welcome. There is nothing more natural between allies. I did what I could. Now, it's up to you. As for me, I'll vote for Mortimer. Good luck to you. Good luck. All right, well, we were successful in all but one of those. Good. I mustn't lose too much time. <laughs> so trippy. See you later, my Lord Duke. Have a nice rest. All right, so now back to Mortimer. I wonder... I don't suppose we could rest... in our room. Could we? Where is it from here? It's close, isn't it? Back this way. Okay. I'm just going to double check to see if we can uh, take a nap in there or what have you. No, nothing. Okay. Inferno by Dante. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer is giving to his guests. Very jolly. Okay, so let's find the path up. It's one of these. Uh, actually, I think it's this one here, isn't it? Yeah. I'm gonna have to jump around a little bit. So it might not take too kindly the fact that we didn't succeed on all of them. However, we should have the majority vote. And when we're choosing between the two evils, Mortimer or Gregory, like, they're... <laughs> I don't trust either of them. We were following Gregory. I don't know. It's, who knows? Who knows? We probably just got manipulated too easily. Louis, there you are. Well, tell me, how did it go? I did my best. Whom did you manage to persuade? Uh. So, Duchess the Hillsborough. Duchess will follow us. She will? Marvelous. I'm gonna ask. But why didn't you tell me we were brother and sister? Now, Louis. Don't blame me. I thought, as you were going through a very difficult time, that you had enough on your plate without having to cope with having a new sister. <laughs> Otherwise, you can be sure I would have told you sooner. Uh-huh. You can count on Cardinal Piaggi. Ah, perfect. I had a feeling old Giuseppe would be able to follow me. You can count on Mr. Von Volner. Really? Well... <laughs> I must admit, I'm stunned at your success there. I truly believed he would never betray Gregory. Well, 
President Washington is going to side with you after all. Ah, I was sure that was all a misunderstanding. Very good. Listen, Louis. Congratulations for what you've just accomplished. It's not perfect, but it's still quite a feat. But not enough, given that the vote must be approved unanimously. We're going to lose. Don't worry. I couldn't have been any more persuasive myself. You've done the hardest part. I'll take over now. Okay, nice. Let's see how he handles it. Conference room. Meet me there and let's get it over with. <laughs> that bird. I was like, what the hell? My friends, here we are at last, gathered together to close this conference. I would first of all like to thank you all for making the time to be here and lend your services. Gregory, I, I believe I may speak for both of us when I say that we are honored by your presence here. You, you are perfectly right to do so, William. Thank you for putting your faith in us and for coming here to participate in this conference. Thank you for helping us to make the best decisions. And I especially want to thank you, William, for, for perfectly hosting us at your home during these past several days. I'm not sure all the guests would agree <laughs> with that. In any case, yeah. Holm doesn't seem to be himself. Good. I think we can begin. You will vote in turn on the question that interests us today. Are you for or against the transfer of ownership of Louisiana from Spain to France? Monsieur de Richet? Oh boy. I vote for. Duchess Hillsborough. Four. Duke Manuel. Against. Duke. Your Eminence. Four. But I. Gregory, please. Monsieur Napoleon. Four. Mr. Von Volner. Four. What? But Gregory, <laughs> please refrain from oh interrupting boy. the voting. This is going to go so bad. You know the rules, oh, whoops. brother. What the hell? President Washington? Four. The votes are now cast. The project is therefore approved. Dirty traitor! Mr. Godoy, soon you will be in charge of passing the territory of Louisiana over to France. It will be done. What have you done? Me? Nothing, dear brother. Didn't they say it what? had to be unanimous, but then... <laughs> done? To hmm. me? What have I done? Nothing, Gregory. You did it yourself. A word of advice. In the future, oh, that is, if you have one, don't drink someone else's cup Whoa. of tea without checking what's in it. Father, what happened? Sir Gregory, what's the matter? William, what have you done? Not now. Whoa. Oh. You, you are mad, William. I will, will punish you for, for this. He will probably try, unless I get to him first. Oh, he's but gone for it. I okay. Cannot die. No, you cannot die. You are, however, losing all sense of reason, as well as all your special abilities. No way. What? What did I? Drink. Can't you guess? There are but few things that can have such an effect on such as we. You would know that if you ever ventured even a little way off of father's beaten track. I... Revenge! Oh, no, my dear Gregory. You will not be taking any revenge. You will die stupidly, alone, enclosed in that rather withered body. Help. Help me. After several centuries Help. of near absolute power, here you find yourself on your hands and knees, hoping in vain that someone is going to help you. Tell me, what does that feel like? Never happened to me. Jesus, this is he's dark. Be good. You cannot leave your body. You cannot project yourself elsewhere. You cannot even contact father. Go ahead. Try. But you are my brother. So I ask you to remember that all this is your own fault. 
and I want you to understand I get absolutely no pleasure out of it. Well, very little. You swine! A new order is born today, brother. Enough of father's hegemony. After all these years of servitude, I can finally stand up and oppose it. You chose to serve him, whatever his excesses. Now it's up to you to face the consequences of that choice. <laughs> Matt, <laughs> I am stronger than, than you. Whoa. Okay, 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 okay. Look at all of that. Holy frick. This is, I don't trust either of these dudes. To be, like, I've talked about this before, but I just, I don't trust either of these guys. So, if we have a way to screw over both, I'm gonna do it. But, we'll see. We'll see if we're allowed. Okay, so I got four points here. Is there anything? Here, let's equip these. Oh, I can't. Uh, let's see. This is... Vigilance, Manipulation. Okay, so Manipulation is a way off, and Vigilance is a way off as well. So we got four points. Is there anything that we can finalize? <sighs> Not really. Not really at all. Um, the closest would be Occultism, Science, Subterfuge, or Questioning. So I think we should dump them all into one of those. That's tough. I think I'm gonna go... Uh, actually, this one. Logic. That gets us the closest. I feel like we likely won't be able to finalize any of these late ones, but... What on earth is happening? Am I dreaming or? Louis, it's me, Gregory. Listen, Whoa. we don't have much time. But where are we? Louis, I brought us here. You must act swiftly. What? I can't hold out for long. William has poisoned me. He must have used the blood of a former demon. I am no longer able to enter the body of someone else. The poison is gnawing away me from the inside. I, I'm going to die. But where are we? In the ether. What you see is not real. It's only a mental projection created by my spirit. I'm occupying William's spirit at the moment, but I'm not going to be able to keep it up forever. Join me, Louis. Otherwise, all will be lost. Yes. Yes, I'll join you. Find a way. Hurry. I must find them quickly. What? Find Sir Home. Beneath your compassion, we take refuge, O oh Mother of God. I deserve a great destiny, and I will let nothing, nor no one, stand in the way of my dream. History will remember me, and the sacrifices I made. I sense that... Something is happening, but I could no longer move. Dear God, if I lose the war against France, I will be doomed. Good God, I can't even move, but Louis can. What's happening? I couldn't tell you. Okay, okay, right. Right. The paintings. But there must be a way. Rational. Rational and open, Sarah. Think, damn it. Think. Sarah? Is that you? Louis? Louis, can you hear me? I'm here, Louis. Can you see me? Of course, but I don't understand. Oh, merciful heaven. You can see me. Yes, I... Louis, I don't know what's happening, but you must help me. Look, j just calm down. 
I can't see you, Louis. I'm here right in front of you. No, I can't see you. The Ks are deserted. I can't leave, Louis. Help me. You died. Died? No! What are you talking about? Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're dead. I am right here. We're not on the Ks. Yes, we are. I haven't moved. We're in the I ether. You, I wish you were right, but you're not. It, it would seem that we're in what they call the ether. Their world of spirits. I was sure it existed. <laughs> the poor woman is completely losing touch with reality. <laughs> I think what she's lost touch a long time real. ago. I daren't try understand. I... Am I condemned? Look... Neither of us know anything about this situation, really. Help me, Louis. You are the first one, the only one to see me, to speak to me. Without you, I'll never get out of here. Don't leave me like this, I beg you. Listen, you have to stay positive. Seeing as I've entered the ether, I, I must be able to leave it. If it's possible for me, then it's possible for you. Do you really think so? I do, Rational yeah. And open. Look at the paintings, Remember? I think. I, yes, right. You are right. There must be a solution. But how come you can move around? Don't I'm know. Not dead. I don't understand. I think there are many things that you don't understand. It doesn't matter. I trust you. You are going to help me, aren't you? I hope I so. I must be getting on. I, I can't stay much longer. Louis, I beseech you. Promise you're going to help me. I mean, I don't know. Of course I'm going to help you, Mother. Thank you, Louis. I trust you. Oh, boy. <laughs> Thank you. But there must be a way. Rational. Rational and... Oh. So we saw the painting on the other side of the wharf area, but... Remember when we came over here at, like, the very beginning? I'm just curious if there's anything calling back to that, but... Looks like no. There must be a way. Rational. Rational and open. Rational and open. Rational and open. What am I doing here now? N nothing seems real. It's trippy. Oh, there's us too. You are nothing but a coward. What a bunch of amuses you are. Please, keep calm. Oh, and she's... Earth Wait, is going on here? They're all, everybody we've ever run into is here. I don't understand a thing. Louis, don't waste any time. Appease them. My thoughts are becoming confused. Help me. What? Be quick. Yes. Not a minute to lose. Press X to reorganize the characters depending on their affinities. What are you talking about? Wants to isolate me again. That's not really Elizabeth. It's another demon who wants to protect home from Mortimer. On a symbolic level, he should be placed between the two of them. Uh. Okay. So what? Okay. Hold down to move a character. He should be placed between them. God damn it. I don't understand a thing. I'm doomed. Emma is completely lost. She needs to be close to her sister. As for Emily, well, she no longer trusts anyone. Apart from me, that is. I have to stay by her side. Okay, so that means that these guys need to be close. And she needs to be close. So, like, that would work, but we need to see how these other guys filter in. Stay with me, Louis. We must take Alice. So, we need to be next to her. So, what I'm thinking is maybe I can put her all the way at the end. Wants to isolate me again. I can count on my father and my son to defend me. Yes, 
but will they make it in time? Okay, so father and son. This is his son, which means if I move him over, why can't I grab him? Oh, I just can't talk to him. Okay. I won't let him attack his brother. That's not really Elizabeth. It's another demon who wants to protect home from Mortimer. On a symbolic level, oh, the two of them. oh, I misunderstood that. Okay, so it's like this. Okay, okay, so he wants to isolate isolated. Again. That's not really Elizabeth, it's another demon who wants to protect home from Mortimer. On a symbolic level, he should be placed between the two of them. But does that mean... So I wonder if they need to be, like, actually in between like that. I can count on my father and my son to defend me. Yes. But will they make it in time? Okay, so then... We can put him here, maybe? Son to defend me. Yes. But will they make it in time? That's not really Elizabeth. It's another demon who wants to protect home from Mortimer. On a symbolic level, he should be placed between the two of them. Okay, so that's the case. He's isolated. I can't analyze him. God damn it. I don't understand a thing. I'm doomed. Emma is completely lost. She needs to be close to her sister. As for Emily, well, she no longer trusts anyone. Apart from me, that is. I have to stay by her side. Which we are. I have to protect my sister. Help me, Louis. Emma is completely lost. She needs to be close to her sister. As for Emily, well, she no longer trusts anyone. Apart from me, that is. Okay. I have to stay by her side. I need to keep an eye on them. Emma is completely lost. She needs to be close to her sister. As for Emily, well, she no longer trusts anyone. Apart from me, that is. I have to So stay all three side. of these are just the same thing. Stay with me, Louis. We must take Alizie back. And then we need to be next to her, I'm guessing. We'll do this, but one thing is for sure. My mother and Volnor have the same objective. Oh to find that book. They're following the same trail and, and must be close to each other. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So... So she needs to be next to him. What if we do like this? And then bring me over here. And then swap those. Cool! Ah! That's neat. Like I've succeeded. They've all disappeared. Louis, it's worked. But don't waste any time. Yes, I'm coming. I don't feel like I'm wasting any time. The exit. Been working my butt off here. What the hell? What the? There's another painting there. What? What are you doing here? <laughs> what? You. It wasn't enough for you to let me be killed. You have to come here and stop babbling away at me. Fool. You couldn't have stopped her from shooting, could you? Uh, okay, I mean, come on. Wait, Emma. You're the one who passed yourself off as Emily. You Damn decided it. you wanted to play with us. You pushed your sister to the edge, and now this is the result. It's got nothing to do with me. 
I only wanted to exist for one brief moment. Spending my life in her shadow, being her double, it wasn't enough. I get it. I must have taken up too much room again. That's not what I said. Only appearing to carry out the basest of chores. How ungrateful of me to want to exist, to make my own choices. It suits you to think that it's all my fault. Be that as it may. Louis, we have no time to lose. Help me, please. What on earth is she talking about? Come on, I... You're dead. No. There's got to be a solution. I am made of the same stuff as you. I already survived a gunshot at point-blank range. I will survive this. Help me. I'll go mad if I stay here any longer. I must have been here several months. I, I stopped counting from... Hang hmm. on. What are you doing here? Are you dead? No. Sir Gregory brought my spirit here, but I must get back as soon as possible. So you should be able to help me. I don't know. Emma, I have no idea of what's going on. How do you expect me to help you? There must be a way. I beg you, promise you will help me, Louis. <laughs> We're just going to promise everybody. All right, all right. So we can down. leave. We'll see I'll what do happens. I'll everything I can to get you out of we'll here. We'll sort it out Thank later. Thank you, Louis. I knew you were a good man. Right. I must get going now. Just stay calm. Everything will work out fine. Louis! No! Don't leave me. Louis! Filthy Is anyone scum, there? I'll kill I can hear you. I know you were there. Okay. Help! Me. help. I said I would help you, and then she calls me, me filthy scum. It's not fair. I don't deserve... I must be quick. My memories. I... I'm losing my sight. I... Louis? Are you there? Yes. Yes, I'm here. Pick up the thread of my thoughts, Louis. Of my memories. Make haste! Reconstruct the sequence of memories of Sir Holm. Oh my god. I must speak to you. And coincidentally, who arrives at the same time as Emily? 